Hello dear viewer, I'm bored and so today I'm going to take what little spotlight I have on YouTube and share it with those less fortunate, the people on YouTube who get little to no views at all. This is One View Wonders. YouTube nobodies that don't get views, it's time for the One View Wonder News. Why do these people get no views at all? Well, with my patented system of using assorted nuts to award merit points to those people, let's explore the world of the unseen video on YouTube, shall we? <laughs> Unfortunately, YouTube no longer has an option for actively searching for videos with no views, so I've decided to use the filters Review and Today, Today meaning May the 5th, and going to the last page on the list in order to get random videos with 10 or less views on them. Now, a lot of people in the past have accused me of bullying these kids, so here's a disclaimer before we proceed. <clears throat> I don't endorse any attacks on these people. Anything I say in this video is for the purposes of having fun and making fun of something people would otherwise not know existed. Please send your hate mail to asarkeesian at feministfrequency.com. All right, so that's over with. Here's today's lucky picks! Ah hell, let's just start with the one pictured in the screenshot I took. Just got the 80 percenter handbook, and it's the greatest gift for those into soccer betting. Easy to understand, easy to apply. I bought a lot of guides before, none really stood the test of time. Thank you for the unbelievable work and time you've put into this. Respect. Alright, so first of all, despite the fact that it says review in your video, let's not make any mistakes. This is a really badly acted advertisement for a book that no one but the dumbest rubes in the world will buy. Allow me to show you what your video looks like to me. Hello, Clean Cut McGuido Douche here to tell you about a wonderful book that I just read. This is the best book about soccer... soccer betting? Really? that I have ever read. I totally read it every day of my life and it has improved both my money situation and my sex life. See this soccer ball that I have here? It totally demonstrates that I am a fan of soccer and that I bet on matches every day and make lots of money off them. I am totally not being paid $20 to say this on camera. <sighs> Respect. It's not a word I'm often used to hearing. <sighs> what am I doing with my life? Alright guys, can I have my $20 now? Jesus Christ. Alright, shameless invisible ad guy, you get an entire peanut for your efforts. And I'm not gonna crack it for you. You should use the $20 you got from your ad to buy yourself one. Next! All right, this looks promising. Look at that happy face. First video Taylor's nail polish review. Because why not? People buy nail polish after all. The immense demand for nail polish reviews must be stagger. Oh, five views. And two of them were me. Ah, let's see what you got. Hi, so my name is Shelby, and I'm going to do a video. <laughs> okay, so this is my YouTube account. Um, and I just got it, so this is my first video, and I'm going to do a review on my first video. So, I'm going to do it on nail polish, and just so you know, I absolutely love nail polish. And she chose as her username, Nawit the Average Girl. She's going to show us how not average she is by talking about nail polish, something I'm sure no average girl talks about at all under any circumstance, not even under the pain of torture. Um, this is called Taylor's... Blue, if I can turn it around. Like I said, I'm not familiar with this. It's called Taylor's Blue by OPI. Heck, already this is a better commercial for a product than the soccer betting book guy. Kudos. So pretty. Now, Taylor has a story. She was a 15 year old girl who died in a skiing accident. And I felt really bad for her. And, you know, her brain shut down, but her rest of her body was working. The doctors knew she was going to die. So Taylor said to donate her organs. One lady who did um, heart. Okay, I came here expecting to see your review on nail polish. I didn't expect the story that the nail polish companies sold you in order to facilitate the sale of more nail polish. 
I mean, I can't imagine this story. 15-year-old girl on her deathbed going, this, I created this blue nail polish. I'm dying. This is my last will and testament. Please sell more blue nail polish. <laughs> okay, seriously. What is your opinion on this nail polish? Give us your review. Favorite ever. Like, I don't buy anything else with that. And I'll figure that out later when I make videos. So, yeah. Pretty much. <laughs> wow. What a detailed and insightful review. Hey guys, here's my review of League of Legends. Ready? Favorite game. Like, I don't play anything else. Oh my god. Holy crap, that took so much effort. All right, little missy, you get a whole cola nut for your efforts. Not to be confused with uncola nuts. Cola nuts look like organs up close, and you can paint it blue all you like. Ha 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 ha. All right, next. No, I'm just going to introduce myself real fast. I mean, not like y'all care. Like We said no, next. This is my first video of YouTube. And today I'm going to show you a toy review. So this is Ninja Toys Review, a video put up on May 5th by username Tanner DeSanctus. Hey, I have a bunch of those ninjas too. This ought to be a treat. Like, comment, and subscribe? Whoa, let's not get ahead of ourselves, kiddo. Show me what you got first. And most of my videos I'm going to be probably doing some gaming. I will do some toy reviewing. Again, let's focus on today before we talk about our future together as faithful viewer and content provider, shall we? And they're really hard to find. The only ones, I mean... Oh yes, dear viewer. These ninjas are so hard to find that these days you can only find them in Ace's closet. Let's see here. Next to my collection of famous boats from all around the world. And in a bucket being held in place by a bust of my own face. And you thought I wasn't humble and narcissistic, huh? Let's see. And here, right on my Spider-Man bed sheets, I will pour the contents of this bucket out and... What the hell? One Piece playing cards. I remember those. Let's see here. That's Sid Highwind with no spear. He doesn't count. You're an alien. Fuck you. All right. Ninjas. There they are, see? You can only find these in Ace's closet. Ninjas. Ninja. And a Zangief. A lot of them were from my older brothers that gave them to me. But most of them I had to buy from a, from a machine in, over in Fry's. Okay, first I'm going to start with the pink ninjas that I have. I don't have a leader. I have. I don't even know if they have a leader, but this is one. I call this a the guard because he has like a baton. The leader of the pink ninjas is known as the guard because he has a what now? Because he has like a baton. Ah, gotcha. He's the king of his ninja clan, so only the costliest of Luxembourgish beers will do. I see. A baton, huh? This. Is my favorite of the pink. Like, the double-sorted ninja. They should make a movie about that. The double-sorted pink ninja. I'd totally go see that. It's pretty awesome. Next, I have the orange ninjas. Whoa, whoa, now wait a minute, kid. I don't have all day. Are you really going to show us every color in lots, one by one? With your narrative style, it'll take all day to do that. Yeah, you get a cashew. Now shoo. Here's a really dark blue ninja. Well, those were today's lucky three YouTubers. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you for spending a few minutes with me, dear viewer. Now I'm off to play League of Legends. Till next time!